Hi, this is John. Uh, I'm working on an air conditioner, and um, this situation here, they had a the air conditioner. See, this is a split system. This is in their attic. This is their evap coil, their heater, and then uh, down below is their uh, on the ground is their air conditioner. And what I was getting is a compressor, uh, is a scroll scroll compressor started bypassing. What that means is the pressure was building up so much that it was causing it to internally bypass, making a hissing sound. Uh, so then I, uh, at that time, I only had the low side pressure hooked up. And the readings all look normal. Uh, on the low side, superheat was uh, reasonably normal and everything was going fine. And after about 10 minutes is when it started hissing. So right away I put hooked up the high pressure side right away, and it's an R22 system, right away the head pressure started climbing to 300, 400, uh, and then until it started bypassing. So, uh, right away, uh, um, I checked the, uh, just recovered the refrigerant, or recovered what I needed to, um, and here's what the problem is. Um, as I suspected it was gonna be, if you look right inside this orifice here, there's a piece of like black charcoal blocking it. It's right in the dead center of this uh, orifice right in here. Uh, in the very center, that's supposed to be a hollow tube. Uh, and it's plugged with uh, black soot either from, what happened was the compressor was pr replaced maybe a year or so ago and there's no filter dryer in the system. So that black stuff just got right in there and plugged it up. Let's see if I can get a better look. But it, it's blocking it, uh, so I'm going to go ahead and clear that out, and that should solve the problem. And also a tricky thing, too, was they put the panel right in here, of course, but they ran these lines. Can't go this way with the panel, can't go that way. So I had to bend it out just to get the panel out. There was, like, no way to get it out without bending it. Sometimes I have to cut it just to get it out, so... If they would have ran these refrigeration lines up higher and then over, then it would have been easy. And that's it.